Hey everyone, this is Deanna. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm coming on with just a hopefully quick uh, overview of my December daily. I finally received this beauty in the mail. And it is gorgeous. Let me show you the inside. It has her name on every um, page. I haven't got to it. I just received it last night. And I know I'm behind, but I'm super excited. I've been documenting notes in my phone. And um, it's I have a zillion ideas running through my head. I've been watching videos and I decided those weren't helping me because I don't have all the fancy um, ephemera and stuff for a uh, December daily. And I'm a newbie, this is my first one. So I'm just, I wanna just do my story. And um, so I just, gathered some things and thought that I would start there. So my first thing was I created this envelope and I'm gonna put it in this top. Um, it's gonna be the start of my album and it says Hogue Family Christmas 2023. I put these gold foil trees on here. I, it's really, funny because I ordered this die and I was expecting like you know big bigger and I get this little die and it's tiny and it was stuck underneath the flap of the box this huge box that came in I almost didn't see it um, but anyhow but they're cute so and it was expensive I couldn't believe it but and inside, I made a tag, so it does go like this. But on the back, I wanted to reflect 2023 for our family. And when I talk about my family, that includes our oldest son, who lives in California, our middle son, who lives in Hawaii, and then our youngest son was killed nine years ago and I still add of course him to anything I document so um I just last night sat at my computer and it's kind of wonky and I I don't know if I'll redo it or just keep it as is because it is my first December daily but I just did an overview of 2023 and what, how blessed we really have been. Um, bet so between the good, the bad, the ugly. Um, so I wrote a little thing about my husband and I. Um, we've been married for 38 years. And then I wrote about my son, my oldest son and his wife and our middle son and his girlfriend that live in Hawaii and our son Bradley who's no longer with us and my dog Callie girl who's the love of my life. So I just wanted to reflect a little bit and like I said that's gonna go there. If you remember I made this pocket here and I was gonna put it over here on the front like that, but I'm not sure. I haven't decided. I might do some extension tabs here with some cute little flowers like here and add it in the book, or I haven't decided. But the first couple stories I have, I wanted to show share with you. Let me move this out of the way. So I have a sprocket. Um, we do a lot of hunting and uh, camping. And so I bought this a long time ago. And it prints little 2 by 3 sticker pictures. Right from my phone. 
and it's easy peasy, but the first story is on Friday, December 1st, our football team, the Washington Huskies, the UW, took championship of the Pac-12, and we played the Oregon Ducks. It was a nail biter, and we are undefeated, and we're heading to the Sugar Bowl, and I just, that's, that's a really exciting story. My son graduated um, as an engineer from UW, so that's my first story in December. My second story is, if you can see, this is my son in Hawaii and his girlfriend. It's his birthday and they flew over to the big island. They live on Oahu, but they flew over to the big island and um, they're at a really nice dinner for his birthday. So that's my second story. My third story is my dog. This is Callie Girl, and she is so precious. She's nine and a half. I, um, my sister gave her to me um, right after my son was killed, and she's she doesn't leave my side, so she's very precious. And with all the flooding and rain, and I'm talking buckets of rain, cats and dogs. So we don't like to go outside and get soaking wet. So we play toys in the house. And yeah, I mean, I raised three boys. I know how to throw a toy or a ball. And I planted it right in her moosey, right in the Christmas tree. So she gently went up and removed it. And she took her own sweet time. It was so, so cute watching her. And then she went to her bed and she was so proud of herself. And then, <laughs> shrink dinks say what? Um, Sugar Plum wishes shrink dinks Look how cute for my December daily. So I couldn't wait to show you these. He, I put, I hauled these off the Happy Crafter shop, um, the beads and this bow. And the other day I just was playing in my craft room and I couldn't wait to make some shrink -a -dinks. So much fun. But these are so darling for my December dailies. I can't wait. I, like I said, I'm just getting started. So I just wanted to share those with you. So, and then I just have this tray and I have some snowflakes cut out. Like I said, I don't have any fancy um, stuff. I just cut out some of the collection from the digital collection and as i go i'm just going to add um to this and i i just decided i i'm going to use what i have and i'm not going to go um go order hundreds of dollars worth of stuff because i need it or i want it and then this is another inspiration. Um, I have these um, Lindor uh, candies I picked up at Costco and I was just putting around and I put that together. So I thought that th this would be really cute. It has a stocking stuffer or whatever. I just took some cellophane and wrapped it in that. So, <clears throat> you know, something for your crafty friend or whatever, you know. So that's just the start of my December daily that I wanted to share that I'm so excited about and the shrink -a dinks of course. And then I have picked twice for the giveaway. Nobody has claimed it. The nice list, um, you get the paper pad, the sticker and the ephemera. And so I'm going to repick here. So I saved the names. I took out the other names. So good luck. Good 
good luck. And the winner is Nettie Creates. Nettie, yay! So um, you have 48 hours to reply to this um, to this video and just let me know that you saw this. And I believe I have your address because we actually did a private swap and we're waiting patiently in the mail for our swaps because the mail is running late. We both should have received um, the packages, but we haven't. So we've just been um, chatting back and forth. So I'm really excited for you, Nettie. So congratulations. I hope I inspired you some how. If you have any questions about the shrink -it inks or digital collection or anything else, leave me a comment. I'd be more than happy to share with you anything, <clears throat> um, my knowledge of what I did in this video today. Um, so if you haven't subscribed to my channel, I hope you will. I have another giveaway coming up and some more fun tutorials and hopefully I can give you updates on my December daily as I go along because I'm excited. I just would like to share and inspire, but um, have a great day and I'll catch you on the next crafty, crafty video. See you later. Bye.